Hey Scorpio and welcome to your weekly love tarot readings. These readings here are intended for Scorpio Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising to those cross-watching as well. Okay, the reading here is going to focus on their biggest regret. So as long as you hold a romantic interest in mind, a special someone as I do this reading, it shall apply. So I'll give the cards a shuffle and we'll see what is their biggest regret here about you and about the connection that you shared. Okay, you've got the Two of Cups and the Star card here. Alright, someone here, I feel like... Okay, this person felt a very strong connection to you here, Scorpio. This is someone who felt, who feels like you were a soulmate energy, you were a twin flame. Um, they felt like this was something truly special, okay? What the two of you had was something very special, something very destined. They've never felt this way about an individual before here. But I feel like this person here was a little scared, okay? I feel like this person was scared of emotional intimacy. This person was scared of transparency because what's happened is having you in front of them was almost like having a mirror to, to, you know, holding up a mirror to them. They saw so much of themselves in you. You guys share so much similar passions and interests and being around you felt really comfortable to them. It felt like home. To this individual this is someone who developed a very strong emotional connection with you but I feel like this person was really scared here to show you um, not necessarily who they truly are but I feel like this person was really scared of you getting to know them on a more deeper level this person was scared of love I feel Scorpio The biggest regret here is that they never told you here, okay? They were never open and honest about their true emotions, okay? They never, they've kept something from you here. It's not, could be a secret or could be information, but something here, like it could be something that happened to them, like some sort of trauma that happened to them in the past or something about their past relationships or some wounds that this person has, you know, has yet to heal. They allowed for this to get in the way of your connection here. And unfortunately, this person still holds that regret. They're still hurting. They're still hurting to this day here, Scorpio. Okay, you've got the King of Wands. This is someone who I feel like is not confident in coming towards you now. Or this person feels as though um, if they do reach out and connect with you, they're not confident that you might respond to them. They're not confident that you might, you know, um, be willing to entertain having conversation with this individual somehow they feel like they've lost control like they felt like you guys started off so strongly you know it, it was such a powerful and such um such an intense connection and then something spiraled out of control for them here okay the king of pentacles this person was it may still be quite focused on career i feel um well, this is someone who's a little bit self-centered here and self, um, self-absorbed. Sometimes this person, I don't think so that, okay. So at times this person felt as though they probably should have paid you a little bit more attention or they should have paid closer attention to this relationship. A lot of the times they pulled in, like they even canceled maybe dates with you or failed to arrange dates with you purely because they were working late or working longer hours or there was something you know or some sort of financial decision financial situation that they had to take care of so this person regrets not putting you first this person regrets not um not prioritizing this relationship they kind of regret at one point they started you treating like an um like an option rather than a priority, right? They regret the way that they've treated you and the way that they've acted towards you. They were very stubborn here as well. They regret not being a little bit more open-minded or a little bit not like not as flexible here when it comes to this connection. Okay. They regret hurting you. They've let you down here. They've let you down. They've emotionally disappointed you here. Um, I feel like it's this person that walked away and this is something here that still hurts them to this day. They've somehow turned their back on you and turned their back on this uh, on, on this connection here, okay? Um, also, they didn't open up. Again, I'm getting that this person, and this is probably their biggest regret here, is that this person never truly opened up emotionally to you or internally. They never really told you what was going on internally. Um, I feel like this person has issues, uh, like has wounds that need healing and 
this person has never healed their previous wounds in the past. And as a result, you know, being with you here, because they've never healed those wounds, the, those wounds that aren't healed, they tend to reopen and they'll forever tend to bleed into, you know, you know, into the present and into the future. And this is what's happened here. This person was hurting or this person, you know, was trying to heal a past hurt or a past situation here, but they never spoke to you about it. They never really opened up and let you in. And this person regrets it. And I feel like they've walked away here before actually giving you a chance to fully understand who they truly are. They regret walking away from you because they haven't been able to replace you first and foremost and they even regret thinking that you are replaceable here Scorpio okay the two of pentacles again yep makes sense so this person regrets treating you like a like an uh like an option and not a priority here okay um this person played around here. They weren't taking the connection seriously. They were playing around here. Again, I feel like their focus here was elsewhere. There might have been someone else involved in the picture here. They might have cheated on you. Because why did they turn their back on you? Or this is your energy. You feel as though this person betrayed you. They stabbed you in the back here. Um, they've broken your trust. They walked away on you. They walked away from you. They said they'd never leave. Isn't that what they said to you, Scorpio? That's what I'm getting for some of you. They said they would never leave. They said they'd always be there. And then they just up and left. There's a lot of regrets that this person has here. A lot of regrets. And they regret not treating this seriously. They regret not taking, um, you know, not taking this connection seriously. They regret playing around here. They regret playing around. They regret focusing all their attention elsewhere when they probably should have focused their attention on you. Eight of Swords, yeah, this person never came forward with something. Um, and even to this day, this person, even if you were sitting there in front of them, they'd still have a hard time letting you know what's really going on with them internally, okay? Um, this person didn't act. When they had the chance, they had the chance to reconcile with you or they had the chance to reconnect or at least explain themselves, offer an apology. They had the chance to try and work through this here, but they didn't take the action. And that is their biggest regret here. Okay, out of all the regrets that they're holding on to, that is the biggest regret. And they say, you know, um, psychology says that the biggest regrets that we have is the actions that we didn't take rather than the actions we, you know, we, we uh, did take. Because now they're left wondering what could have been and that is a heavy emotional weight to carry what could have been between the two of you could have you had a a life or a child together the life you know the life that they've envisioned could that have you know gone according to plan this person is is left wondering what could have been between the two of you what kind of life what kind of future could the two of you had had together and that's something that pains this person Okay, they didn't see it there. Look at that blindfold. Okay, whilst they were in that connection with you, they were busy playing around. Um, you know, they were very stubborn. They were too self-absorbed here, too um, selfish here to even you know notice. So you know, when you were in that, con when you were in a connection together and a relationship together here, this person didn't see it then. They see it now though. But I wonder. For you scorpio if it's a case of a little too late okay guys that's all i have for you thank you for watching and listening please show your support by subscribing to the channel liking sharing commenting i will be um, sharing with you more tarot love readings later in the week so stay tuned thank you guys again bye for now